Assalamu alaikum everyone and hello. Oh yeah, and Jumma'a Mubarak obviously because you know it's Friday. Okay, today I'm going to be showing you how I did this hijab. So um, I gave you the option for you to like wrap it around like this or just leave it loose. So I would normally just leave it like this but you know, whatever. You can do what you want. Okay. Yeah, so if you guys want to know how I did this hijab look then stay tuned. I'm gonna just go through what you guys need. So you need two pins. So one, two. And then you need a safety pin so that you don't bleed. And then you're gonna need a scarf, a nice scarf obviously, and then you're gonna need an underpiece. So this is my underpiece, just a neutral colour. Okay. So, yeah. so what I've got on right now is my headpiece and my scarf around my neck because I can't show you my neck. So what I do is I basically just tie my hair in a bun and then I just put the headpiece on and then I just put on my hijab over it. So I'm going to take off my hijab. Okay, you can't see my neck. Okay, so I've got my hijab. I place it on my head and then with one um, side being short and then one side being long. I take about zip, I fold it basically. So I fold about that much. I fold about that much and then I bring it forward. And then what I do is I make it like, I take these two parts and I just like fold it like that. So it creates this type of look. So if you want to bring it forward to cover like some of your eyebrows and if you don't, so yeah. Then when I've like secured it, I take the um, safety pen, I open it. Okay, so I take my safety pin and place it and then I lock it so that I don't bleed. Wait, I'm trying to find a lock. There. So yeah, locked it. So remember, short piece, sorry, and then long piece. And then what I do, I just make sure none of my neck is showing from the back. So yeah, like a fairy. I take the long part and I just wrap it around like so. My cat's here. Okay, we'll go now. Okay, back to what I was saying. So I've wrapped it around, and then what I do is I take this part from the back side, and then I just bring that to, like, bring it there so that my neck doesn't show. Get the short side, make sure, like, it's... You could either, it's optional, you could leave it hanging, or then you could just, like, attach it, and then, <clears throat> like, wrap it. I take this part, and I wrap it around like this. Or you could either just, like, take this part and then wrap it, and then take this part and wrap it like that, but... I don't do that normally, I just like leave it like because I'm not bothered so it's okay at least your hair is not showing. So yeah, I haven't finished it because I take the um, pin and then I just attach it here so that nothing comes out of place like so. So this is not going to you know, flutter around. Well this part will but not the top part. So then I take this one and I, I take this part and I just tuck it in like that. Sometimes, but sometimes you could, but you guys could just leave it out if you want, whatever floats your boat. And you take this other one, and then I just pin this here as well so that nothing comes off. Ouch, that really hurts. Okay, be careful by the way with pins because you know. Okay, so. This is the hijab look, so just like a normal fluttery hijab. Hi everyone, so today I'm going to be doing a hijab tutorial and an outfit idea for this hijab um, look, which is my everyday hijab and also I've got on this cozy outfit for the winter season. So I'm going to learn how to create this hijab look 
and to see what I match this hijab with, then keep on watching. Okay, so what I've gotten right now is my underpiece and it's just a neutral colour. This is the hijab colour that I'm going to be wearing. So what I do is literally bring my hijab, one um, side is quite short and the other side is really long. What I do is I take about that much, put it behind and place it on my head like that and I, I don't like the underpiece part to show so what I do is I fiddle with it until it doesn't show so that's fine and then I take a safety pin and I just pin this in place and then I take the long side and I just wrap it around so literally like that and then I take because it'll look really weird from the back when you do this so what I do is I take some of this part and I just place it at the back like that. And then I just like to make it a bit more volumized. And then I take this pin and I place it here. Just to make sure it doesn't move around. And I'm out. And then um, if I want, uh, I take another one and I place it there as well. Maybe at the top. Because if I place it there it will look more look like this and I don't want that so I'll just place it on top here like that and that's it um I sometimes do this it depends on what outfit I'm wearing and if I like the um t-shirt I just do this so that it shows I'll keep this hijab like this but you can do that if you want obviously um and yeah, uh, okay, so the next clip is going to be me styling this hijab with an outfit. So if you want to know how I do that, you can take ideas from it. So if you want to know how to do that, then stay tuned. Okay, so this is what I've styled this hijab with. I've got this Aztec um, patterned cardigan. I've got this um, denim dress on. I've got my black jeans on. <laughs> 